What's going on guys? It's your boy Chris here from Day Traders Lifestyle TV. We are here for another episode of Market Strip Down Saturday. All right, it's Grand Prix time. Let's do this, baby. Let's do this. Let's go. Yeah, I'm restless, so give me something to do. Yeah, I can't stay here because I need to dance. Jump, jump around and show them how I move. Uh, uh, oh, uh. Everybody will be on me. Wanna join me when I take a shot? I'm gonna find a crown so I can put it on me Swinging from the chandeliers, I won't be sorry I got a feeling I'm gonna crash into this party I'm just an accident waiting to happen like Chris from Day Traders Lifestyle TV. We are here for episode 26 of Markets Trip Down Saturday. All right. Um, first off, like always, we're going to start with gold. My prediction is that we are going to get rid of this line and then we are going up from the current market price. As long as we close above on this weekly candle. Um, which, like always, my weekly candle closes an hour after the market opens, 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. So as long as I get a close above the 14.11.52, I'm looking for a push up to the 14.35.7 with a retracement down to the 13.82.33 by the end of the week. Um, just to show you what it looks like on the weekly I'm expecting it to close above this wick here on the left of the crosshair um, and then have a slight push up to create an upper wick and then a collapse from there to start a downtrend somewhere back into this area over here. Um, and we'll either find a support level, push back off or continue back down. But keep in mind that is the weekly time frame. Let's head over to USD Jappy now. USD Jappy, I'm expecting a push down to the 107.59 and a push up to the 108.92. Obviously, like always, if these levels get broken, more than likely the analysis is invalid. Um, so always keep that in mind. That is the way I trade. I trade at the farthest possible entry. Um, so if it was to come down to here and it broke below and pushed down to here, then obviously this is going to become invalid, right? So that is the way that I personally trade. Let's head over to Euro USD now. Euro USD, I'm expecting a push up from the 112.689 to 113.167, somewhere in that area. Looks like a pretty good um, spot. I can drop in a nice resistance here and it correlates with the other trend lines that I have drawn in. So it looks like a good area for me to sell at um, with an end, end target take profit of 111.82. Last but not least, let's head over to GBP Jappy. GBP Jappy. <coughs> I'm expecting a push down to the 135.37 with a push up to the 136.56. Possibly even up to and around. Oh, oh you want to move for me? Um, possibly up to and around the 136, 98, 137. I hope you guys enjoyed another episode of Market Strip Down Saturday. Like always, hit the like button, smash the subscribe, and share it with your friends and family. Peace.